friends. Uh, today, uh, I was going to ink up some pens, so I thought, why not do a currently inked? Right now, I think I have one more pen inked. Actually, that's downstairs. So, I have very few pens inked. One of them is almost empty. Um, and I have... Uh, three more pins that I want to put ink into. So, how are we doing this? Let's just... I guess we normally just write them. Okay. Should we bring you closer? So we'll call this June. <laughs> June 2023. Uh, this ink is one that I picked up on my trip. So Is my Twisby Go Clear Medium Nib the ink is online lilac. I think it's usually a little lighter than this. I haven't written with this in a few days. Next up is my Veco Vecao Clear with a medium nib. The ink is Wearing Goal Twelfth Night. And this one is courtesy from Amanda. Let me see what this looks like in swatch form. I think this was actually a really good pen choice for it. Uh, fun is that you can see all of the shimmer in the feed. It was a pretty juicy pen. And this pen, I this is like tribute to Amanda right here. Because <laughs> this is the Twisby AL Mini Grape with a medium nib. I know. And I inked it with Black Urban Amethyst. Lural. This is like so lovely. I have to say, I didn't post, make a video of getting this because like you all have seen me getting pins before. I like writing with these without them being posted. And Everybody will say, oh, it's not backweighted at all. And I suppose it's not, but I feel it. Maybe I'm just a delicate flower. Now, see, it's a very... Um, whatever, I don't know what to say about the palette. So I wanted to get something bright in here. I just realized I'm picked. Hmm. So I'm going to go with Merchuis. Pardon, don't know how to pronounce it. 
magenta. In my totally understated and subtle the new Grand Scepter. This looks like this new grand scepter medium. It's like too wet. And ink is Ackerman. Mauritius magenta. Nice, nice, nice. And inking up another pen. This is the pen we got in our most recent ink flight, the online campus. So I'm going for another ink from this name to be. I gotta write this down though. I like tracking when I've inked a sample up. This is Well, you know what? Number one, I dipped this way too far in. Number two, I don't think I rinsed this. Well, that's probably okay because Amanda doesn't always rinse her pens. We're doing an ink for Amanda, so, you know, as they say, when in Rome, So this is the online campus, and this is a, a, in black with, I think, a medium nib. The ink is Robert Oster times Atlas. There, we'll pretend that that says Atlas. Sh -sh 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 -sh. Polar Vortex. And the last ink, um, I felt like doing something cozy. Something that would just be nice. So yeah, Sailor, California. And we'll put that in. My Bennu Talisman, the Edelweiss color. And as some of you may have guessed by seeing that I'm even making this video, I'm not actually going to do 30 inks this month. I don't 
didn't really have the time. And I would have had to like film weeks ahead. I'm just not up for it. So apologies because I know I said I would, but I did intend to. And as we know, the best laid plans go off to awry. This may any talisman device rod. I just can't write today, huh? That's fine. Sailor fifty states California. That's not a party. So well, here we are with our June currently inked lineup. I don't think that this pen is going to stay inked much longer. <laughs> you can see there's so little in there. And I actually inked and used a pen that did not even get added here. I had a um, my Twisby Eco Tea in Mint with Sailor Manuel Coque. I really liked that. Um, but here we are. This is what June looks like. Mostly a sedate lot. So, whenever you're watching this, I hope you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.